Uh, what do you think is going to happen with Kevin Owens now after beating John Cena at Elimination Chamber? Wrestling talk. So that was huge. Were you shocked? Jim, um, Jim Ross predicted it. Um, <laughs> I, I, I went in thinking that Owens was going to win. Here's my problem. It was a good match because of the Owens victory, and there were some great spots, all basically on Owens. Um, when he... When Cena po- uh, came out of the pop-up powerbomb the first time, I uh, I was uncertain. It was long. It was a very. It felt like a very long match. And basically, for Owens to beat Cena, first C- match in WWE, Cena had to, but Cena kicked out of every single thing Owens threw at him. You, well, you expect that. Yeah, but I mean, dude, you really have to see the match. Like, it's just it's exhausting. I heard it was a great match. It was like a four star match from I read. Four I read uh, it was a good match. Four star, maybe three point five four star. It, it, it's it's good because Owen wins, and there was a lot of good spots. It's good to see younger talent coming in and in their first WWE match, watching them have I, enough faith in them to go over Cena. I think that's. I think I think it was a. I hate to say it is a bad decision. If you're going to do that, you should have done it with Bray Wyatt last year, a guy that was around for six, seven months. To do it with a guy in his first match, that I hate to say it, a lot of a lot of these people, some are watching NXT, but the casual people watching on TV aren't. They're like, "Who's this guy? He shows up on Raw twice, has a match, and beats the face of the company." Uh, um, you know why? It's because uh, Elimination Chamber was a network only uh, pay per view. The people who have the network are watching NXT. All right. I just think it's weird that they don't have Rusev win. I, I want Rusev to win at WrestleMania. I thought it would have been great if Rusev won. I, I would have liked that, too. Um, and then, yeah, Bray Wyatt. Now, Bray Wyatt's now a joke, almost. He, I don't think he has a feud going on. He doesn't. I think he lost to uh, Ryback. I don't. I haven't watched in a while, but it's weird to do that with the guy who's a champion of NXT because that means you're going to now bring him up to the main roster and have him drop the belt or you're going to combine it. It's just a weird move. I'm not saying it's, it's obviously good to give him the rub, but that rub could have been given to someone else, and it's not like Cena's going to job again anytime uh, soon to someone cleanly like that. You know, it's not going to be like he he's lost clean to me. he's lost cleanly to maybe five or six guys in uh, fi- in uh, fifteen years. Well, the other thing is, is you know, I think they're looking at a lack of credible heels, and uh, it makes them credible, obviously. It, well, they're stuff. looking at a lack of credible heels, and here's a guy that they had demolished Sami Zayn twice who's a fan favorite and arguably just as good of a wrestler as Kevin Owens. And they have him come up and they have him destroy Cena. They are building this guy to be the next monster because they need one. When, that when could have been Bray Wyatt. It could it have been. been and, Rusev was built, being built for a year to be that. He was undefeated. You know, Rusev could have continued to be that way, but Rusev is injured now. And now he's injured. Bray but. Wyatt, They. I will agree, I liked Bray Wyatt. They never gave Bray Wyatt a good program. They never gave him a good program. Well, they did, but he never beat Cena. He never he never beat the guys who went up against, except for like Jericho. It was the only guy he beat. So uh, really, yeah. But I, I'm happy. I guess I'm just happy because, because uh, first of all, uh, people would say, "Oh, you can't have monster heels." Sure, you can have monster heels. You can have you can have you can book them right. Wow. You can, Kevin Owens is a monster heel. The first one I've seen in forever. You, you can have guys like that. You can have guys like Lesnar that destroy people. And I'm sorry. I think it. I think Owens makes a more convincing heel than Lesnar does. I don't. But okay, he's better on the mic. Yeah, but he, he Lesnar is a, a, a monster looking. Owens doesn't look like that guy. He, he doesn't look like the typical wrestler. He he has a he has a beer belly. You know, he doesn't have the, the chiseled abs. I'm not saying he can't wrestle, but he doesn't look like that. But they, people, I, were, but people are already talking about building to like. I hate to say it, they're already saying, what if Owens is his big heel and Lesnar comes back as a face eventually? That could be like a huge match or oh, yeah. that'd be amazing. You know, but ha- having a monster heel around, especially regularly, which Lesnar wasn't, gives you a lot more options, and plus it gives you a lot more unpredictability about. Oh, maybe he will beat this guy cleanly, and not just you know what I mean. Like maybe and, he will tear through people. That's one of the things I liked was when he won, and my buddy and I looked at each other. We were like, "Wow!" So what? What can't happen now? Sure. Um, you know when I, when an NXT guy's first match on on a, on a WWE show is a victory over Cena clean. No, I mean, maybe that shows that Cena. Oh, 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 well, Lesnar destroyed him on a pay per view. That was a big deal last year at SummerSlam. Well, so it was funny because my friend and I were talking. We're like, we're getting ready for the match to end, and we're we're at this point. Like I said, I went in thinking that they were going to let Owens win, and then halfway through, I'm like, they're not going to let Owens win. And and my buddy goes, he's at the goddamn age where he needs to be putting over the new talent. And then mm-hmm. three minutes later. He did. So if Cena wants to keep doing that, I'll have more respect for Cena. 